Well, morning, folks. It's us again. It's just Dad and Max this time. Say hello, hello. Max. We're uh, walking down to the pool. It's our last day of the day. Boo hoo, boo hoo. And uh, it's 9.45 in the morning and it's absolutely scorching hot already. Look at the colour of that sky up there. It's absolutely gorgeous, isn't it? So I'm just going to do a little video of a walking down. This is the main road down from our chalet, whatever you want to call it, hut, apartment, what else could you call it? Lodge. Lodge, that's a good one, I right? Lodge is a word. That's a good word, isn't it? Yeah. Lodge. Sounds a bit posher, doesn't it? Yeah. Anyway, oh. We're, oh, walking, yeah. we're walking down from our shed. Yeah, so people coming up through the shadows. It's mainly um, Europeans here. There's not many Brits at all. It's kind of a lot of Germans, a lot of Dutch, a lot of Polish, quite a lot of Polish actually. A lot, yeah, of, a lot, of, a lot of Croatians. Seen a few Czech car edges <coughs> and a couple of France ones. That's about it, really. Um, but yeah, not a lot. Of, not a lot of Brits. A few Irish, but not a lot, a lot of Brits. I think I've spoke to one person from England who was a, a fella from Cornwall, uh, and that's it. Um, but it's scorching, so we're going to have the well, last day. We're going to go back down to the pool. We're heading off early now to try and get there for ten o'clock, so that we can get. Uh, and, and we'll like, what, what, what do we call them? A cabana. A gazebo. One of the ones with, with a big posh bed on it because it's uh, a lot more comfortable. It's not more comfortable than just the Absolutely, it certainly is, isn't it? It's a lot more comfortable, isn't it, dude? It's eh? normally real beds, but we, like, we normally just lay down towels. Yeah, if the bed's in direct sun, the bed's in direct sun, it's hot on the there but we'll put the shades around it and on the morning to be honest the direct sun's not in the afternoon on the morning um on the morning the sun's not too bad on that side of the bed so uh, we're racing down to get there for 10 a.m because that's when the pool opens if we look over here this is where a lot of the rvs and stuff are but it's weird it was really busy last first few days we came here but now there's loads of spaces so if you've got an rv should get yourself a uh, trip to Croatia, shouldn't it? Hey? Yeah. Should get ourselves a trip to Croatia. There's Max there in front of us now. Look. It is me. Right. You keep walking, Max. I'm just, I'm just following you. We're coming to the corner here. Max, turn in. Now, if you head straight down that way in front of us, there, that takes you right down to. One of the beaches, but we're going to turn left here. Also, by the way, um, last this night we went to the to reception. Like a, um, last night we went to like a like a hip hop dance show. Yeah. Yeah. Um, what did you think of it? I I quite like it. Yeah, I think you enjoyed it a lot. I think Louis found it a little bit loud. So I saw him grabbing his ears a couple of times. Yeah. But uh, this bit here is nice and shaded because we're under all the trees. You can look over there. See all the trees and look all the way, all oh, the way around yeah. here. Oh. So this year, all these gaps here, these are normally got like caravans and stuff. See them a little bit more on this side as well. And there's seems to be quite a lot of spaces at the moment, which is rather weird considering it's kind of late June now. Uh, little yeah. supermarket there. That's the one we've probably gone to more than. Pladine is the big supermarket outside the camp. We went there and got a lot, like big couple of big shops. This is the shop we normally go to. Yeah. Well, we want to get some waters. That one's the more popular one. Yeah, it's because it's easier to get to, isn't it? Yeah, closer to our lodge. That's an early that, That's more closer. Huge to car park here. Yeah, there's a mass, massive car park. So I think you can come and stay here and just buy like a day pass to go to the beach and things like that. But we've got wristbands and things that. Show that we're staying on camp. I've been wearing this wristband for seven days. Yeah, six days at the moment, I think. Yeah, so ahead of we're coming up here. This is another nice little bit, and you come through this car park not the car park, the car park's a car park, 
It's a bit boring. Car park is boring. It's a bit boring, isn't it? Yeah, there's car parks go. There's car parks. So I mean the car seem to like it. Don't they? Yeah. The car seem to like it. But uh, we're gonna head through these trees here. Yeah, and there's a like a life. Cross this way, Doodle. Yeah. I'll show you a bit. Yeah. So we'll go through here. Bit, that far side over there, that's kind of all the, where all the apartments and things are. Watch this reversing car. There we go. Um, so you come through this middle bit here. Again, this is another nice little shaded cool bit. The other day, just in them trees there, yeah, we saw a woodpecker, didn't we? There. Yeah. Yeah. He wasn't pecking wood though, he was uh, just pecking into the ground. I mean, I think it was a woodpecker. It certainly looked like a woodpecker. Yeah, it did have a woodpecker. Yeah, it had a big long beak like a woodpecker. Yeah, so here you've got like a nice little watery bit of seats. And along here you've got the obstacle stepping course. stones, oh. obstacle courses, a Max likes to call it. And then you just wind your way through here. A couple of guys sitting in the shade there, look very sensible. Watch out, water. Talking of water. Um, the other day, when we were driving back from um, Zadar, and uh, we got an Uber to Zadar and back, uh, about it's about twenty euros each way. Depends upon the time of day. Um, it started chucking down with rain, really hot. Anyway, we're not going that way because we're going to go this way. But that's the middle bit where kind of all the bars and restaurants and stuff are and all the shops. Yep, we're taking the We're taking the quicker way down to the, down to the pool. So it's quite a walk, so you need to be fit to come here. Pardon me, a little bit of hiccups there. Long this way, dude. Yeah. So, we're heading down through Another nice little shade of the, the thing. The nice thing about here is because there's so many trees, uh, you can always find a little shade. So, yeah, so these are all like, the apartments and things. We've, we've not stayed in these before, we've always stayed in the camping lodge sort of type of things. Yeah, um, I mean, say it always. Oh, it's only the third time we've been to a Euro camp. Uh, we've third been here, time? We've, well, yeah, no, we've been here twice and we went to. Lake Gara Bella Italia, didn't we? So yeah, so this opens up to this lovely bit here. Yeah, we might see cats around this bit. Yeah, so you might be able to see just in the distance there, there's the sea. So you can you can chill out in these little trees down here for some natural shade or you can, on the beach you can just buy a sunbed and an umbrella. Quite expensive I think. It's seven euros for uh, bed. a bed. And it's seven years for an umbrella, and uh, they only get two they're, beds. They're, in the they're dark. a bit like they're a bit like the police pro uh, patrolling up and down. Uh, yesterday, though, we managed to avoid pain because every time they came near, a bit sneaky, I you know. Every time they came near, we kept going off either into the sea or away from the beds. Um, and after three o'clock, they basically give up. So if you go to the pool after three o'clock, you have to because you have to pay for beds at the pool. If you go to the pool after three o'clock, you won't get charged. I'll just let these guys cut cut through here. This way, Max. Yeah. So if you if you can sneak sneak around, if you can be bothered. I mean, today we're just gonna, we want a gazebo, so we're just going to pay for the gazebo. Um, which is 30 euros for all day, but that gives you everything. It's, we can get all four of what on a gazebo, two adults and two children. It's basically... And it's got like shaded cover on it as well, so... Well, it's and it's my last like... day, so why not? And we've got a bit of money left over. And... I, we we eat in some nights and we eat out some nights as well. And so it, it helps and... good okay. the holiday a little bit. I uh, said so today I, I'm planning to just spend all my money because what's worth having money after all of it? Like, have you still got some money left, have you? Yeah. Oh, are you going to pay for your own uh, burger tonight? Tonight we're going to go to um place, oh, we're going to go to Nain. There's a nice burger and pizza place, uh, quite sort of cool street food, isn't it? 
And it's called the Mad Dog. We've been there. We went there last year, and we've been there this year as well. And it's quite, uh, it's quite good, isn't it? And the burgers are nice, aren't they? Yeah, burgers they are, are nice. This yeah. is another place. And I had a, um, I had a black door pizza. So anyway, we look around here. So these are all the trees, look. Yeah, and you all can the way around here. Down at the beach. And there's the pool there, but to get to the pool, you've got to walk all the way around this way. Maybe not advisable. Uh, two two little kids on a thingy that's maybe uh, a bit too big for them. I would have said, but there you go. What do we know? Health and safety. <laughs> they don't seem to really care about health and safety. We got an Uber back from yeah, Sadar, and um, Mom and Max and Louis were in the back, and Max was in the middle, and there was no seatbelt across the middle from them. The guy was just going, the guy was just going, it's okay, it's okay. We were going, it's not really. Um, but we sorted, we sorted out a solution in the end, didn't we? Yeah, we, um, we just like tied. And he didn't, he didn't drive crazy, so I suppose it was okay in the end. But I still wasn't. He didn't you know, have a very lax uh, attitude towards health and safety. But that's uh, that's foreigners for you, isn't it? Yeah, that's, sorry, foreign. not foreigners. That's Europeans for you. Anyway, so we're getting round to the pool again here. Have a little view of the umbrellas. I love Mike. Oh, Look at that there. gorgeous sky. Yeah, we did, didn't we? Yeah, and um, but you see that there? Oh yeah. Uh huh. That's like a go kart thing. Go mini, mini, mini go karts. Yeah, mini go mini driving school. And uh, Max has been on twice. How many? Louis's been on twice as well. Well, no, he hasn't. He's been on once this holiday. Yeah, yeah. Daddy's um, twice. Louis went on last year and um, bashed his leg and. We wasn't going to go on this year, but we managed to persuade him, didn't we? Yeah, we managed. And he we went on, a... and there was there was no major accident. So there was no was major ones, but I did have uh, two crashes. Yeah. Two, just two normal crashes. Yeah, there was a bit of a bit of, a bit of a crash, but not too bad. Anyway, I think we've got here in time. Yes, because it hasn't opened yet. Wait, it hasn't opened? No, ten o'clock. So we're going to sign off now, see you later.